how to replace the battery on the tile. Put this in a vise or G clamp and just get a hacksaw to take the edges out and just saw all the way around. You've got quite a bit of uh, leeway there. There's about five mil. So when you're sawing in, you don't have to worry about damaging any of the components. Uh, the last bit, you basically get get the end of a spoon or something in there and just prise it, just to prise it open and then crack it all the way around. And then you've got it separated like that. Now this is stuck down, so we need to release that. As with all types of glue, the best way to get it unstuck is to heat it up. Hair dryer. So the first thing is there is like a plastic shield around that. And after I've heated up, this came off a lot easier. Uh, so now it's heated, what I'm going to try and do is get like an edge of a spoon, I think underneath there, just try and prise it off. Okay, so there is a soldered metal uh, tab there. Uh, so I'm going to remove this tab, which then will allow me to then unsolder this one. Uh, and then the battery should come off and then I'll be able to sort it out then. Okay, I found it easier to do the bottom one first and then the top one. But now it's free. Heat up this tab, grip it here, and then use brute force. You have to use brute force to pull it off. As you can see, it's actually been punched in, so it's actually been pierced together against the battery. So you have to just give it a good old delicate yank. Place the bottom tab back and solder it in. Place the battery, put the metal tab on top, solder on. Now that's all back on, I'm going to use a glue gun to uh, reattach the casing. It's never going to be pretty, but at the end of it, it's watertight. 